Telling is not teaching. Comp is a management system that empowers both the students and the teachers. Do we have goals for our students in the classroom? Teachers talk too much. It's very down to earth. And it just jumped out at me. I thought, that is so simple. Let's look at your responsibilities. I'm not the only one that's gone home crying or wanted to quit. <laughs> Comp is one of those programs where it doesn't matter whether you're a first year teacher or you're an experienced teacher. There is something there that's going to be of tremendous help to you. I feel like that there's hope. Comp is a common sense approach to classroom management a vital tool that helps teachers lay the foundation for student achievement. This table is really on fire today. They're hot, they're ready. Since 1989, more than 95,000 teachers and administrators have participated in comp training. Many, like Brianna Wilman, come to comp wondering whether they've chosen the right profession. It went through my mind, maybe I should just quit or I should just move you know, away, somewhere far away. But um, I knew that I was determined to stick through it and I really knew that there was you know, some kind of help. I just didn't really know where to get it. We did good. Brianna found the help she was looking for in comp. If you say you won't work on time and legible, but accept it late and messy, next time you'll get it okay. later and messier. Okay. Mm -hmm. During the three-day workshop, New and experienced teachers learn how to create well-organized classrooms using research-based techniques. A teacher on the feet is worth <laughs> how many in the seat? Five, Five in the seat, yeah. Teachers also attend a follow-up session to reinforce and share what they've learned. But what stuck out was the point where it said, give them the wait time first and then call. And I thought, I have not been doing that because I'm so anxious to get to the person, so. COMP uh, is a federally validated program based on over 4,000 hours of observation in more than 500 classrooms. One of the things that became very evident was that teachers who were effective instructors were also good classroom managers. Dr. Carolyn Edwardson and her research colleagues noticed that the children in these well-organized classrooms were not only cooperative, but were excited about school and had high academic achievement. Dr. Edwardson then identified the techniques and principles those teachers used to orchestrate smooth-running classrooms. The result? Over 15 years of research and valuable tips from effective teachers, all distilled into one workshop, COMP. The irony is you come out of college and people tell you to have rules and do this and that, and they never tell you how, and COMP is the, the missing college course that we never had. So it would have saved me a probably five to six years of anguish. Hey, can I tell you what I do? At a comp workshop, teachers work in several groups so everyone can exchange ideas. At comp, I was so encouraged. I mean, all the teachers there were so helpful in everything that they said, and comp just gave me so many ideas. And you have four scenarios there. When several teachers or an entire faculty participate in comp, the sharing and cooperation continue. We are more on track together. When uh, children go from one year to the next year and switch teachers, that's a difficult transition for them. But comp helps us keep on the same page. The kids know what to do, the teachers know what's expected, and it makes everyone get along better. The kids, the teachers, everyone feels more satisfied. Thumbs up if you know what morning do is. Claudia Russell says before comp, a lot of her teaching time was wasted on discipline. I feel like I was running a daycare. Now I feel more like a school teacher. I feel like that I'm, I'm doing what my purpose is. I'm teaching children. Clean your tables up, please. Russell says comp helped her curb discipline problems by showing her how to establish effective rules and procedures. What's the action word? That's the easiest thing to pick up. Before comp, my kids would tend to um, not follow the rules. I would tend to have to remind them a lot. Whereas after comp, after I started being more effective with my rules, the kids started to have less behavior problems, and as a result, they felt better about themselves. But it's cleanup time, and that's your job. Is to clean comp shows teachers how to reinforce the rules even with the youngest students. They can't read what the words say yet. So when they see uh, the picture, and of course we go through these things day after day in the beginning, um, they come to know what the rules mean just by the way the picture is illustrating that. So who can tell me what are your directions? What are you going to do? Josh? Dinah Ray used tips from comp to cut the chaos that used to ensue when her kindergartners moved from one activity to the next. 
if you don't have a plan, <laughs> there's no telling what a five-year-old might do. Now the So I implemented things such as the singing, uh, the, sometimes we do little dances or, or movements so that they can get from the mat to their chairs. And it's not a race. And they're going to have something wrong. So wait, before we move, we got we to know what we're doing. So No matter what age students you teach, COMP will help you plan specific strategies to improve your classroom. Because every classroom is unique, you decide which techniques will work for you. The thing I like about COMP, is, uh, as opposed to several other workshops I've been to, is that it is not a cookie cutter program. It doesn't say all teachers need to be a certain way. That's right. Some groups you never end up with anything because they're struggling for power. Who's going to COMP helps teachers integrate skills in managing both the behavioral part of the classroom and the academic part. You mean if I have a question I need to raise my hand? That's correct. Where are we going today? One of the ways COMP helps you gain control of behavior and academics is through classroom organization, details such as how desks are arranged. This configuration in Brianna Wilman's class is one of the successful tips she got from COMP. The people who pass out the sticks are going to take up the sticks. She also implemented a classroom management system that saves her time and doubles as a good behavior incentive for students. Uh, after the changes that I had made after COMP, I realized the kids were starting to respect me a little more, were starting to um, just follow my rules more. They were just doing things in order, like I had asked them to. Increased cooperation is one of the areas where teachers have noticed improvement after COMP. 11,000 educators surveyed also reported increased control of the classroom, enhanced feelings of competence, and more time spent in academics. Inappropriate and disruptive student behavior also decreased. I didn't go home stressed. I was able to get things done. I felt more, um, I felt more satisfied. I felt more rewarded. Um, you know, I just, the whole environment was better. What about your y-axis? Up or down, left or right? Up or down. Up or down. Comp helped me get the kids involved. It allowed me to see what they know and what they don't know. They're participating, and instead of being a disruption to the class, they're actually involved in a positive way. By assigning roles, the timid kid, he doesn't have a choice but to complete his role. Studies have also compared the academic achievement of students who have comp trained teachers with those whose teachers did not have comp. In classrooms where teachers had been through the comp workshops, we found that those students actually had higher achievement in both reading and mathematics. Special ed students in regular ed classrooms also had higher achievement scores than those whose teachers had not been through comp training. I think that really underscores the effectiveness of COMP because these children are being reached. Teachers are able to reach them and they are benefiting from being in the inclusive classroom. Educators are also finding that COMP helps them teach English as second language students. Because it gives them some direction, it gives them expectations. Even when they walk in the classroom and they may not be very good in English, those procedures they can pick up and they know when they're doing what it is that they're supposed to do. A teacher on the feet equals five on the seat. <laughs> COMP is based on research, and research proves it works. Very good. good. The proof is also in the classrooms of thousands of teachers who depend on it. COMP is an answer to my prayer. I enjoy my job more because of the comp workshop, um, because my stress level is less, and I'm a more organized teacher. It has really helped me become more confident with my teaching and how I handle the children. None of us is going to be perfect at all of the aspects of our job, but having the comp training is just one more great tool to help you be a, a, the best teacher you can be. If you really want to excel in your craft, and you want to feel comfortable in your craft, then the Comprehensive Organizational Management Program, which is COMP, is a must. This has been invaluable, and I've been teaching a long time, and you can teach an old dog new tricks. <laughs> With COMP, I have found that out. <laughs> it will make such a difference in your daily structure, your daily organization. It's going to help your career. For more information about COMP, call 615-322-8050 or visit our website at comp.org.